Well, the force says awakened for Hollywood's elite. The red carpet rolled out at the AT, the TL, TCL Chinese Theater in Hollywood last night and welcomed the stars to the world premiere of Star Wars. The Force Awakens is the first Star Wars film produced without George Lucas, the saga's creator. J.J. Abrams directed this new installment. The Force Awakens opens to the public on Friday and has already broken pre-sale ticket records. Several screenings here in Indianapolis are already sold out for Thursday night previews, previews but tickets are still available in some spots. You just have to check around yes. if you're a diehard and want to <laughs> get in on the early action. Well, one Indianapolis man's love of Star Wars grew to new heights with the release of this new movie. And Sunrise reporter Chris Kirshner joins us live from the Children's Museum where now fans of all ages can see his tribute to that galaxy far, far away. Chris, good morning. <laughs> Yeah, good morning, Bruce. You know, I thought I was a big fan. Here I've got my R2-D2 hat with the Mickey ears, but nothing compared to the guy that built this thing. The TIE fighter made completely out of balloons that's now soaring over the Children's Museum. That guy, Brian Getz, joins me now. Brian, a balloon artist. Welcome, Brian. You're obviously a fan. <laughs> yeah, big fan of Star Wars. <laughs> you, tell me about what gave you the inspiration for this. Why this particular well, sculpture. I knew that I wanted to do some huge sculpture uh, hanging from a hot air balloon uh, because I got engaged in a hot air balloon and came up with the idea the next day. And uh, so this one seemed to be a great thing. It already flies. So got all my friends together right before Star Wars uh, comes out here and made a 25 foot sculpture. 25 by 20 by 20, right? Yeah, pretty it's much. a pretty big thing. So we've got some video of how you guys put it together, time lapse video, because it took a couple of days, I know, and many, many hours. Yeah. How many balloons? How long did it take? How many people? Uh, we figure it was about 200 crew hours to do the whole project and about 3,500 balloons total. And then we had a crew of about 25 people total to march the thing across the airport, rig it up to the hot air balloon and take off. So it was really a team effort. And we do want to mention they did not blow up the balloons manually. That's no. a lot of people want to know that. Please tell me he didn't blow up all no. those balloons. <laughs> no, we, <laughs> He'd be we passed have, out. We have hand pumps and we have some really good fancy inflating pumps. Okay. And as a Star Wars fan, I have to ask, why not the Millennium Falcon? Why the TIE Fighter? Well, uh, we wanted to do something full size to really get that scale. And uh, if we did the Millennium Falcon, that would break my own balloon record for the largest balloon sculpture in the world. And uh, we just didn't want to try and fly something that big. Okay, well, we're so glad you did it and so glad that now everybody can come see it. A lot of people I know have. You <laughs> promised me that you're going to teach me how to make a lightsaber out of balloons, okay? I am. I'm going to be the hit with my son if you can help me do this. So All what right, do we need? Let's, what do we let's do get here? going. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We'll give you a couple of these. And we're going to be doing Kylo Ren's lightsaber. Okay. He was the bad guy in the For new film. For the new film. movie, The Force Awakens. So, right? okay. uh, so, and he's got a really unique lightsaber. Okay. So what we're going to do is uh, fold our balloons like this here. So okay. fold them next to each other. Okay. Put your hands like this. Up, up. Uh -oh. I'm losing mine. That was okay. you, not me. <laughs> I'm used to doing it on my own here. All righty. So you, you pinch it there and uh -huh. just twist it around. All right. Yep. You got it. I thought I popped it. Okay. Now this is a half decent lightsaber on its own if you just left it like this. Okay. But Kylo Ren has some uh, really cool things coming off the side like a broadsword. So we're going to fold them. We're going to hold it just like that. Like this? Across there. Yep. Okay. Uh, so it's kind of centered. Okay. And then uh, just do that same thing. Squeeze it and just twist it around. And then once you once you've got it in there, just uh -huh. kind of bend it around so that it stays in one direction. Help almost here. here, almost there. We're, We're just gonna get... put these ones right through there. All right. And hey. so now we have How about this? our lightsabers. You ready for the duel? I am. All right, Brian. Thanks so much for your <laughs> sharing your talent. We'll go ahead and send it back to you guys. Hey, you got me in the stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the oh, best guy too. Yeah, <laughs> You'll be fine. Yeah. It's just a balloon. All right, yeah. thanks. You have some very impressive work with yes. his uh, balloon artistry, I guess it we is. could call it. That's some high pressure work there. Oh. Right. And uh, those, those balloons will work out better than those hard plastic ones. I know from raising two boys.